Everything kind of came into place. It was perfect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Amazing. Honestly, we was watching ringside and we saw you had so much success with the front kick. Is that something that you'd worked on sort of going into the fight? Was that part of the game plan? I, know, I have it in my arsenal and I always forget to use it. So this time we were drilling it, drilling it, drilling it. Yeah, yeah you definitely didn't forget tonight. You landed so many clean front kicks. It was amazing. Thank you. So that's definitely something that was sort of like part of the plan going in. Yeah, it was definitely. Yeah. If someone's obviously coming forward, then we want to try and keep them off and keep them at legs length. And yeah, yeah, yeah. Literally, you, you control the distance absolutely beautifully. I noticed as well, like the the energy of it was quite quite a quite an intense sort of. Uh, it was quite high energy throughout. So I imagine that being extremely exhausting. How are you feeling now? I got told to calm down after round yeah. one because yeah. I was going a bit uh, crazy, but I was just enjoying it so much that I just couldn't stop myself. I couldn't hold myself back. It was great. Yeah. Uh, so obviously, with it being a title fight, is there anything different you did sort of to the lead up? Because obviously, like you said, there's there's a lot more sort of riding on this. So was the fight camp any sort of different for you? To be honest, the fight camp's kind of been like 12 months long because we were having yeah. fight after fight with no breather. Yeah. And so I'd say like it's a massive build up. It wasn't just like a 12 week fight camp. It was the aim from a year ago or two years ago. So. Well, I think the consistency of that has definitely paid off because like say you controlled the distance and the pace, even like you said, like you had to calm down kind of thing, but the pace of it and the distance was so well controlled. So it comes across that it wasn't just sort of a, a short fight camp and it was a consistent was thing. Very dedicated. Yeah, oh, absolutely. Uh, can I just ask as well, with it being a fight camp, obviously you're in great physical condition for it and the fight camp has sort of been like a 12 month process. Um, mentally, was it a little bit different for you going in? Obviously when you came out, you said there was a few tears and stuff, it was a lot more emotional. What was it like beforehand? Um, I knew this girl was a big fighter and I, and I have been against like, strong women before, but she mentally, I know was going to be tough yeah. and she was still laughing at me in like round two or round three. There's so nothing sure. worse, is there? There's nothing no, no, worse. She, she had fighting her 100% and I knew that would be difficult and that was the only kind of stress, but it was fine. Yeah. I could deal with it. Yeah, you, de you dealt with it absolutely beautifully. Uh, can we see the belt on camera there? It looks absolutely incredible. Give it a little lift. There we go. Amazing. Uh, a massive congratulations. Just before I let you go, have you got any socials that you want to shout out that we can all tag you in? Um, JTT Muay Thai, that's my partner's Amazing. Instagram, so you can follow Amazing. everything. So that's how we get you through there. Listen, congratulations, enjoy your night. That was very, very well deserved. Oh, you too, thanks so much. Oh, it's all right, I love it. Well done, thanks very much. Here we 